Hello, this video is a part evaluation of second bimester of discipline of control and automation minister by Professor Renato Dutra Pereira Filho. I am Francine Rangel and my work is about dosage of liquids using peristaltic pump acting with microcontrollator Arduino. In this work, I will speak how was made the modeling of equation of flow rate by average voltage in a peristaltic pump for flow control using PWM. Peristaltic pump is used in laboratory and industry and even in aquarium to dosage of liquids or to keep the flow rate continuous. The peristaltic pump works at the same form of the peristaltic movement of the human body. This is why the pump has this name. It has rollers that compress a tubing, doing vacuum and the fluid be aspirated. The movement is done by action of a DC motor. The figure shows the peristaltic pump it has utilized in this work. It is a pump that works on 12 volt and 5000 RPM. PWM signals vary a average voltage on a load and a shown in the figure. Arduino has six PWM outputs. The tip 122 is a transistor NPM. In this work, the transistors act as one off switch. The figure shows the configuration of tip 122. The figure shows how was made the acquisition of experiment that the pump was connected directly in voltage source to the experiment memory. It was varying the voltage and getting the flow rate in millimeters per minute. Acquisition of the data in the experimental part were plotted in Excel to obtain the equation. The equation 1 is the equation obtained in Excel, where Q is flow rate and V voltage. The equation 2 is used to convert the voltage to range except at PWM output, which is 0 to 255. The system was made in XCOS environment of software Scilab. The mounting of the circuit was done in a breadboard. It was utilized a NPM transistor working as a on-off switcher. A diode in unparalleled sense of the motor current which server like a circuit protection and a resistor of a 1K1. The goal of this work is to automatically control the average voltage that will be supplied to the pump to obtain the required flow rate in MPL per minute. Result in experimental part of the pump was efficient operation and last 5 volts with a maximum capacity of 50 ml per minute and the minimum of 25 ml per minute. The implemented system was successful because the difference flow rates that were exited were provided. Also, you may be continue for purpose of research and development of automatic control strategy, PAGA and chemical and biochemical system. I am grateful to Professor Renato for dedication and I thank the Christian Monitor for calm and patience.